Welcome back to Simply Sweet. I'm Allison Gargiro, and I am here with the Bakersfield Mayor, Miss Karen Go. And you wanted to share your baked brie recipe, something that you bring out to parties. When you are a busy person, you need something that you can just grab and go. Mm -hmm. This only takes 30 minutes, and there you go, ready for your holiday party. I know, and I love that. And so the holidays are a little far away, so we are going to make it perfect for spring and summertime by putting raspberry chia seed jam in there. Super easy to make and delicious. Let's show you how we made it. Yum. First, we're going to start by placing one frozen puff pastry sheet down on a cooking tray. I let it thaw for a few minutes so it's a little bit easier to handle. Then we are going to put one wheel of brie cheese right in the center. Now, I keep the rind on. It's great. It's still going to be melty and ooey and gooey once it gets put in the oven. And then we're going to place some jam on top to give it a little bit of that sweetness. This is my homemade raspberry chia seed jam. So we're just going to take about two spoonfuls, place it on top. Now you can add as much or as little as you would like, but let me tell you, a lot is definitely good. Makes it super sweet. Next, it's time to fold the puff pastry on top. Now there's no real formula to doing this. You just want to be gentle so that that puff pastry does not break. And I'm just going to try to make it into a cute little design, but no worries if some of the jam is sticking out. It is still going to be perfect once it's placed in the oven. Then I'm going to use a fork just to kind of make sure this all stays together so that none of this is going to pop off. This egg wash mixture is just one egg that I beat with a fork, put a little bit of water on top, and this egg wash is what is going to help make the crust nice and crunchy and flaky once it comes out of the oven. We're gonna pop this into a 400 degree oven for 30 to 40 minutes until the top is brown and crispy and you can see the cheese starting to bubble inside. We popped this baked brie out of the oven after 30 minutes, cut into it, and the brie just oozes out and you mm. get a little bit of crunch from that flaky crust, but let's give it a try. I can hardly wait. Mmm, it's so creamy. That brie is creamy. It's so mm. nice once it melts inside and you get a little flakiness from the crust and then sweetness from that chia seed jam. Oh, it's just so perfect, but we would love to know what you guys think and let us know your favorite holiday dish on Facebook, Simply Sweet Allison. Thanks for watching. Professional kitchen and appliances provided by Earners, Kern County's appliance leader.